WWE in 2016 after a six-year absence. Yeah, that's right, Cole. Bliss had alienated the entire SmackDown Live roster in her first few months as the brand's women's champion and had to recruit Mickey to help Bliss win a historic steel cage match. Corey, picking back up on our discussion of Bliss and Mickey James, we saw a familiar pattern play out as Bliss mistreated her friend to the point where Mickey attacked her former partner. Yeah, and when the two met again on Raw, Bliss intensified their rivalry, mocking Mickey James' age before beating the veteran at TLC 2017. Safe to say, we won't be seeing James helping Bliss win any matches from now on. Never say never. And there's a thumb-crunching drop. Look at this. And she's driven to the mat hard. <laughs> It's like someone hit the repeat button for this move. What does Alexa Bliss need to do now? Her opponent clearly has her number here. That is not looking great, but I've never seen her give less than 100%, and I don't expect that to change here. Tags her right in the face. Wisely bringing the action back into the ring. on that slam. The drop kick hits the target. Back elbow. Gee, did you see that? Over the head and then the back drop. Great move. Oh no. I'm afraid so cold. This is going to be great. Look at her go. That came out of nowhere. And that's likely why it was so successful. much all of Alexa Bliss's NXT career and while she was successful there I think she felt overlooked and that's what's fueled her on the main roster and it's Mickey Mickey James with a mick kick Bliss is out of it guys and it's Mickey James making the moves oh spiking DDT that's how you put an exclamation point on the end of a match guys things just went from bad to worse the cover, and this one's history. 